so hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today we're talking about one of the most influential program languages ever created c but hold on we are not just singing its praises we're going to discuss some of the problems and disadvantages of using c so if you are ready to uncover the less glamorous side of this legendary language stick around first up let's talk about the lack of modern features c was created in the early 1970s and while it's incredibly powerful it hasn't kept up with many modern programming concepts for example there is no built-in support for object-oriented programming which is a staple in many contemporary languages like c or python this can make managing larger code bases more challenging as you miss out on concepts like inheritance and polymorphism. Imagine trying to build a skyscraper with only the tools available in 1970s. Sure, it's possible, but it's not the most efficient or easiest way to do things today. In C, you have to manually allocate and deallocate memory using functions like malloc and free. While this gives you a lot of control, it also opens the door to a host of potential problems. Forgetting to free memory can lead to memory leaks which can cause your program to consume more and more memory over time until it crashes. And freeing memory improperly can lead to undefined behavior, which is often much harder to debug. Another significant drawback is the lack of built-in exception handling. In C, if something goes wrong, like dividing by zero or accessing an array out of bounds, there is no built-in way to handle these errors gracefully. Instead, you're often left with cryptic error messages or worse, no messages at all. This can make debugging a real headache, especially in larger programs. Let's not forget the poor standard library. Compared to modern languages like Python or Java, C standard library is quite limited. You'll often find yourself needing to write your own implementations for functions and utilities that are readily available in other languages. This can significantly increase development time. Finally, there's the issue of portability. While C is considered a cross-platform language, the reality is that code can behave differently on different systems. This is especially true when dealing with system-specific features or libraries. This lack of true portability can make it difficult to write code that runs seamlessly across various operating systems, which is a significant disadvantage in today's interconnected world. While C is a powerful and influential language, it's not without its drawbacks. From manual memory management to a lack of modern features, there are several challenges that C programmers need to be aware of. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe to Pythonic Mind for more videos like this. And as always, leave your thoughts and questions in the comments below. Thanks for watching and happy coding.